Soda is known to contain high amounts of sugars and calories without providing any nutrients. And because of that, many may choose to substitute a can of pop for a fruit juice instead. Well, in tonight's Health Beat, Kelly Land Sophie Heineman is talking with a dietitian about whether fruit juice is the best substitute. Nicole McVeigh is a mother of four and says her family avoids drinking soda whenever possible. Just because it's high in sugar, and I'm a nurse, and I know that's not good for you. And my aunt's a dental hygienist, and we know it's not good for your teeth. So we have little kids in a family, so we try to just um, drink water. I see. But soda isn't the only beverage containing high amounts of sugar and calories. Dietitians say fruit juice is also considered a sugary beverage and should be limited. It's found in one in four individuals are drinking more than 200 calories a day in juice or in beverages alone. Aside from the extra calories and sugar, registered dietitian Tiffany Krogstad says if it's being consumed in a sippy cup, it can lead to tooth decay. She suggests opting for whole fruit instead of fruit juice to get the most benefits. In regards to juice, um, the problem is, is that it's lacking fiber and there's, um, so it's not keeping kids full. She says having juice instead of pop is a better option, but not by much. An 8-ounce glass of 100% apple juice contains about 28 grams of sugar, compared to a can of Coca-Cola at 33 grams. I mean, you think about our problems with obesity and chronic diseases. I think that if um, individuals can cut back on their intake with um, their beverages with calories, I think that can be um, potentially really help their um, health. But saying goodbye to the sweet drinks can be hard, and even harder on your kids. McVeigh is substituting sugary beverages with carbonated water instead. We really like it. We just have started trying them. They actually have some in the cart, and um, it's a better option. The kids during the summer, they like to grab something cold. If you or your child is struggling to make the switch from sugary beverages, dietitians say to dilute the beverages with water or switch to a no-sugar drink mix. Ultimately, Krogstad says water should be your go-to beverage, consuming sugary beverages in moderation, if at all. With HealthBeat, I'm Sophie Heineman. For more information on sugary beverages, just go to this story at kelloland.com.